everybody my name is Marcus Stone and in this video I will show you a really simple way how we can add countdown timer for your website in Elementor so let's start the first thing you want to do is just scroll down below to the description and click on the link when you will have it you will get on this site called Elsite. Elsite is an amazing company with a lot of widgets and one of the widgets they make is a countdown timer so let's click sign up for free now when you're gonna sign up for free you want to sign with Gmail Facebook or normal mail it's up to you now when you got it let's click login Straight away here in applications, you want to write in search countdown. And you're gonna see it here countdown timer. So let's create a widget. Now, you can really choose which one you actually like. For example, I like this one here. So let's continue the template. You have three types. So you can start to finish, remaining time counter per visitor. This is what most people are using. You can set the time in minutes and I don't know you can set the time to 10 minutes for example now you can also get rid of the button or you can have it you can change the style if you would like up to you and advanced so this is how we do it and you also like the message before the timer so what I will do now is then I will click save right after it you need to choose a plan if you're starting out with your website, choose a light version. But if you have already 5,000, 50 or 5 million views, go with the basic pro or enterprise version. So let's get a code, let's copy it. Now here in Element, Elementor, you want to write HTML. Take the HTML code and paste it to your website. And let's paste the code here. Update. And let's go back and view page. And voila, here we got perfect countdown timer on our website in Elementor. Of course, if you would like to add like the Elementor above here, for example, you need to go to the appearance theme editor and add it to header under the head. So you would just paste the code here and it would be uh, on your head or on your footer. It depends which LSI template you would choose. So this is how we do it. Quite easy, quite simple. And that's pretty much it. So thank you very much everybody for watching. If you have any questions guys, ask me down below in the comments. I'll be really happy to help you, provide you some guidance and stuff like that. I definitely recommend checking out like all the other applications in LSI if you can find some of them useful. Get a cheaper pro pack or basic pack so we don't need to pay for single applications. Thank you. See ya and goodbye.